In this demo you will see how to add a mobility in MT+. The scenario, used in this video demo, is based on the addition of a mobility for a higher education project KA103, for activity type, student mobility for studies between program countries. Some fields are only relevant for KA103. Fields, which are required for other action types, or activity types, will be missing from this scenario. From the moment of processing the grant agreement signature, in the National Agencies system, Ben will receive an automatic notification from the mobility tool. He logs in, using the associated ECAS user ID and password, of the email just received. First, check that all of the project data is up to date. In case there are changes or amendments to be performed, notify your national agency, and request the changes to be performed in their system. Once the changes have been applied to your project data, in the national agency's system, you will receive an automatic notification. In order to add participant information, and mobility information, click on the Mobilities tab. Click on Add New. Select the activity type. The box Long-Term Activity is automatically checked. The Participant ID field is alphanumeric and is not mandatory. Add the participant's details. Select the participant gender. Add the date of birth using the correct format of day, month, and year. Add the participant's nationality. If required, select the checkboxes for participant with special needs or disadvantaged background. Indicate the number of months of previous participation in Erasmus, if any. The mobility ID is generated automatically and is composed of the project code, letters MOB, and a sequential number. This can be overwritten, if required. The mobility ID must be unique for the current project. Select the field of education. Note that the dictionary value for the field of education is displayed before the term. Ticking the box for zero grant will set all budget items to zero. Tick the box studies combined with traineeship, if applicable. Select the level of study, teaching. The dictionary value is present before the term. Select the sending organization. Only organizations added in the application form are added automatically to this list. If the host sending organization is not present in the list, please add the details of the organization first under the Organization tab of the project. Select the receiving organization. If the host organization details are not listed here, please add it to the list of organizations in the project. The sending and receiving country fields are automatically completed based on the countries of the sending and receiving organizations. Likewise, the fields for the related Erasmus code for each organization will be completed on selecting the sending or receiving organization. If applicable, check the outermost country region box. This will activate the drop down list of the distance band. To select the correct distance band, Use the hyperlink to the distance calculator. Enter the start date and end date for the mobility. Some fields for the budget section will be calculated automatically, and some need to be indicated. The automatic calculation will only occur once the calculate button is clicked. Duration calculated, days, duration, full months, effective duration, days, and duration, extra days will be calculated automatically. Check the box for force measure, if applicable. 
add the length of any interruption in the mobility. Add the monthly grant. If the participant was indicated as coming, from a disadvantage background, then the field disadvantage participant's monthly top-up, is active. The EU individual support is calculated automatically, taking into account the monthly amount, and any top-ups, such as disadvantaged background. Add, EU special needs support, if applicable. EU mobility total grant, calculated, is calculated automatically, only after the user presses the calculate button. Add the main instruction, work language. Click on Calculate. The automatic calculations are performed, and the fields become read-only. If needed, tick the box Edit to edit the fields. The EU Mobility Total Grant, adjusted, must be equal to or less than the EU Mobility Total Grant, calculated. Indicate if the mother tongue or duly justified exemption applies. Indicate the other used languages, if applicable. By checking either of these check boxes, you will indicate if the participant will be given access to complete an online linguistic assessment or online language course. Click on Save. The mobility has now been added. If further adjustments are required, click on the pencil icon. This concludes this demo.